one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Yeah. It's probably been dropped. This one's fairly clean though. It is pretty clean. It's probably like a 40 gig. Come on. It's gone. How much on your controllers? There's like, uh, those, uh, there's a PS4 for $5 and the other one's only $3. How about you storage units? Yeah, okay. Five bucks for a PS4. Well, not everything is complete, you know? It's kind of hit or miss. Take this, 360 control. I was just thinking that. Is it? Can I wait to it? It's still pretty cool. It is a Nintendo, huh? You don't see these. You get on the docking station? Uh, five bucks. Five bucks. You said five on this controller? Yes, sir. What about this one? That one's new. That is part of a bundle I hit. That's 20 bucks. 20 bucks on that? Who are you doing these three? Uh, so, what, you got the PS4? No, these are uh, three. three uh, it's like eight dollars. Might as well take the four for ten. Even if you want the joysticks out of it. Still want two more bucks. <laughs> Let's go with PS2. Yeah, I think that's PS2. Yeah. Yeah, 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 that's what it looks like, yeah. You want it back, sir? No, that's not my back. What do you got on the NES games? Oh, uh, five dollars a piece. Five each, okay. You, the, like, you want these two in this or something? Or we'll work it out. All right. What are you getting on the uh, PS3? Do you know if it works? No, that's it. all I have is a system. They're ten dollars a piece. The ten a piece. Do you know if they work though at all? No. No. I don't, okay. I don't test them unless I hit the cords, and then I yeah. can I can bundle it. But you never know, like what you're gonna come across. No, I know. I get it. So he's like a father to me now. I always helped him. He goes, you know, he made the same bubble. That's cool. Some battleship. I mean, nothing special. What do you got on the DS? Okay. Not cool. Again, you're going to say. No way. Oh, that's cool. Again. Dark tone. Good score. Any, any, anything else to go with it? <laughs> any other game stuff, or is that it? Uh, I got some, uh, set back hey, look, 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 your double dribble. Yeah, there you go. Uh, the track and field, alien syndrome. Yeah, I think they're like mostly five bucks each. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you think that Mustang for it? Yeah. Do you want track and field? No. Do you want Pac-Man? Well, let me look at it closely or... <clears throat> hey guys, what's going on? Uh, welcome to another Sunday afternoon. Um, I've got a bunch of stuff to go through and I'm just going to, well, not go through here, but go through in general. Uh, I spent a couple hours down in the basement yesterday going through stuff. Um, I don't know if you can tell, but I got rid of a ton of PS2 stuff. It's still here. It's just now over there. Um, but I got rid of a lot of my low-end stuff and stuff that I really just didn't want in the collection. 
So, um, kind of cool. I'm going to start being more picky on the stuff that I keep. Uh, but the rest of the stuff is just going to go into like for yard sale stuff. And when I set up at shows again. And uh, now diving into what I picked up today. Uh, pretty much all of this is from today. Uh, there's a couple things from like one other day this week. Unfortunately, after last Sunday, um, this past week I was on vacation and uh, I got some kind of weird virus. So unfortunately, I couldn't really leave the house most of the week and killed my vacation. So kind of sucked, but it is what it is. Uh, I ended up feeling better like Friday and getting some stuff done. Between then, went out and did a little bit of thrifting, but didn't find much of anything. So I'm just going to kind of start with uh, the first thing. Uh, is actually an eBay pickup. Uh, I picked up, I don't know if you guys remember last fall, uh, one of the last Seekonks, I picked up a copy of Kirby's Adventure on the NES, pretty cheap. Uh, well, recently I found a box manual insert. Um, I get it on eBay for 10 bucks. So it's got some issues. Um, and I just popped the bottom of the box again, but um, overall it was a nice shape. The color was nice. So I now have a complete copy of Kirby's Adventure. So I'm into the whole thing for like $11. It's like a $40 game, which is cool. So that was a nice add to the NES collection. Uh, moving on, grab these two guys. Um, I know this isn't video game related, but these are a nice flip. Uh, should be an easy 20, 25 bucks. Uh, I paid $1.75 for it. Uh, and picked this guy up. He's sealed, which is cool. Nice factory seal. Um, just not sealed they go for about 10 to 12 bucks this one being factory sealed uh goes for i want to say it's like 20 25 bucks give or take so that's going to be a nice flip uh for stuff to go into the collection uh going into seekonk today was grant's first seekonk of the year uh unfortunately not in the way not a lot in the way of video games that i um not a lot was found by any of us uh so i grabbed uh two three things uh none was actually actual video games i grabbed all three of these from one guy i got one of these nes docking bay stations uh which is really cool not something i've really seen before they go for about 20 25 bucks uh i paid five bucks for it it's in nice shape whether i'm going to keep it or not i don't know um i don't really have anywhere to put that type of thing so that might end up just going um they like out at the yard sale or when I do one of the shows, I'll set up and have that. Uh, grabbed the PS4 controller for five bucks. Uh, I threw it on my charger for a couple minutes. It doesn't hold a charge as of yet. Um, one of the buttons sticks on it, so I'm going to have to pull it apart. Uh, if for some reason I can't get it to work, I'm just going to bring it to GameStop uh, and sell it there because they'll take it as a refurb, which will give me like 15 bucks for cash for it. So nothing really bad. I paid five bucks. Can't complain. Uh, what did I pay for this guy? Uh, I think I paid five bucks for this too. Uh, it's a PS2 wireless controller set. Um, I'm actually not sure who makes them. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if they're any good or not, but I figured for a couple bucks. Uh, they gotta be cleaned up. They got a little bit of a rust on the back. Not any corrosion, just a little bit of rust. Um, so we'll see if they work. If not, you know what? Sometimes you just throw money away. Uh, moving on. Went to a toy show. Uh, as usual, it sucked. Um, not much. Ended up seeing a 360 controller on a guy's table, and he said he had a couple games underneath. This was the only one even worth picking up. As you can tell, it is sun faded and beat to hell in the box. Uh, it is complete. Uh, let me see if I can pull it out of here real quick. Doop, 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 doop. Whoop. Yeah, so it's got the cart and the manuals in there. You can kind of see it sticking out. Um, I paid five bucks for it, so not not bad. The cart alone is worth that. Uh, maybe someday I'll get another box. Otherwise, it'll just sit in the shelf as is. But a tension game, so kind of cool pickup. Uh, and last but certainly not least is all this. Um, <laughs> don't get too excited, the boxes are empty, but you would know that from watching the video. Um, same guy at Grafton had a bunch of empty boxes and manuals and stuff, and you know me and my boxes and manuals. So Grant and I went through a bunch, he grabbed, what, two, 
grabbed the Star Tropics box, which I already have complete, and he grabbed two Link boxes, which I already have complete. I actually have both versions, so I didn't need them. Although one might have been an upgrade for me, but he needed it, so he just took them both for five bucks a pop. So basically everything here, if you do the math, uh, I paid 40 bucks for it. Not a bad deal considering. Um, the Super C makes mine complete. Uh, for some weird reason, I don't have Dr. Mario or Lolo. Um, so those are just going to kind of be put away for now in case I ever do get them, I can complete them. Uh, the Sega Classics has uh, one disc. It's got a Sherlock disc. I think I have the other disc, but I know there's a couple different versions of it, so I might have a different version of it. I don't know. Uh, Mortal Kombat, I don't have a manual, but I do have the cart, so I'm still looking for a manual and an insert, because there's no insert. But overall, uh, not too, too bad condition box. It's fair. Um, this was kind of cool find. It's an empty case, but it's got the extra little booklet, which I didn't have for mine. So that was worth it alone, and I also have a loose disc of this sitting around anyway, so I'll keep the booklet. I'll finish this one up with the lose disc that I have, and then sell that copy off. Uh, and then a bunch of manuals. I don't have Battletoads, but, I mean, a Battletoads manual, why not pick it up? Uh, Demon's Sword was actually an upgrade, because mine was a photocopy. And then, you know, just a couple other manuals and stuff that I had. So, always nice to pick this stuff up. So, as you can tell, not much, but a couple things, uh, short and sweet. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't get anything done this week that I wanted to do. Uh, due to unfortunately being sick, so things are going to get pushed back. Um, but once everything's up, you guys will know because you'll see it on the channel. So I appreciate it as always. Uh, we're really close to 4,200 subscribers, which is awesome. My last video really took off uh, as of this morning. was at like 4,200 views, which is great uh, for just under a week of being up there. So I don't know if you guys want to let me know why that one took off as opposed to some of my other ones. Um, you know, any pointers is great. Maybe it's just that point in time where my stuff is actually getting out there really well and people are liking it. So, really awesome either way. Uh, so, I always appreciate it, guys. Thanks for watching. If you want to get in touch with me, Facebook, Instagram um, are the best two ways. Send me messages. I've been going back and forth with a couple people. I know i got to get back in touch with a couple people about some toy stuff. I just haven't had a chance to dig, unfortunately. Um, and i got somewhere i got to be in about an hour. So, that stinks. But it is what it is, and so be it. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. I will see you soon. Thanks. Please like, share, subscribe, comment, the whole nine yards. And I'll talk to you soon. Peace out.